Hi friends. Okay. So this morning was a disaster. Um, I got on my little Chromebook, right? Turn the sound down because I woke up at like 4.30 this morning. Um, I live in a mobile home and our walls are really thin here. So I didn't really want to wake up my daughter. So I turned the sound down and um, went on my other computer and started editing, 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 God, I can't even speak today, a video with this computer, my Chromebook completely turned down. There was no sound on my Chromebook. I guess there's really nothing going on up here in the morning without me drinking my first cup of coffee because when I looked at my videos, there was no sound. So my ever thinking brain decided to delete those because there was no sound and put them back up. Not knowing that I had turned the sound off on my Chromebook while I was editing a video on my other computer. I lost views from it. I lost likes from it. It was, it was one of those weird things that happens to me every once in a while where my brain is just not working. And then I did this shift order for this lady t-shirt. She bought three 24 packs of water and some other things, including like three ring binders and stuff like that for her kids school. I told her I really appreciated, you know, how she is involving herself into her kids school and stuff like that. I've done the same thing. I have bought, you know, wipes and stuff like that for my kids in order to take to school as far as their class was concerned. Um, that's just my boy because my boy stays in one class. Um, I have given my two older daughters other stuff to put in their backpack but this lady oh my god she is so fantastic she went out and bought three 24 packs of water for the kids for the class is the thing and and binders and other stuff and I mean, it was, it was, her order was over $200 and half of it went to the school and I applaud her for that. I don't really understand why school districts cannot afford this. Um, I really don't see it. I mean, I do see it as far as what teachers get paid and as far as, you know, what is allowed in the budget for schools. But this lady, she was fantastic. And I will applaud you every single time. She was a wonderful person. We all need to be more like that. We all need to give. We cannot take any more from this world. It, I mean, I don't think this world has anything left to give us. So we've got to give back. And that's my rant for today. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Okay. That's the thing I have to say. I just did a run. And I was at the checkout, which is what you have to do at some stores. And this lady behind me got 
so irritated. The fact that this person was going through my cart trying to figure out if I got everything. It would be the same as me going through the checkout, getting all this stuff myself. But this lady got so upset that I was standing at the end of the checkout. This lady was helping me bag up my stuff, which generally happens at every single store. You know, say, say you're walking up to a checkout and you put all your stuff down on the conveyor belt. You know, she rings everything up. You find out your total. Everything's fine. But this lady just got so, so, so upset because it was something different than what she has seen before. Um, I don't think she understands the whole online purchasing of groceries. But I told the person helping me, I was like, thank you so much. She actually bagged them up, which doesn't happen at other stores. Generally, I have to bring it to my car and I have to bag it up. I don't have a problem with that either. But this lady actually bagged up my stuff. It was, she was so, so, so nice. People just have to understand that there are people out there that just do not have time to go to the stores. And with something like Shift or Instacart or DoorDash or, you know, Uber Eats or something like that, you know, there are things out there which are different nowadays because nowadays are different. People just have to understand that. And I thank the girl so much for helping me. And when I went to my car, this lady came behind me. She tapped me on the shoulder and she's like, don't worry about it. She's like, I understand. It was, it was really nice. And I am sure glad that there are people out there that understand that there are different methods now than going to the store and buying your own groceries. I mean, I still like it. I still love going to the store and buying my own groceries, but there are people out there that just do not have that chance. And I'm glad that there are places like this or the other ones, which I had already mentioned, that actually give people jobs and we're able to go out and help is a thing. Okay, enough of that. I know, I know, I know. All right, let's get on to some better business. I'll see you later.